So I'm guessing before the lady got to the register she had gotten some complaints about her child crying. She's telling the lady at the register not to lose her $6.50 job. The lady working the register said several customers have complained about the child making noise crying. The employee refuses to take care of the customer. Any store does have the right to refuse business from any customer at any time. The customer then throws in the race card, saying if the child was white, nobody would be complaining. Um, my daughter's checking out. She's a minor. Okay, I, it's a free country. I can record. The customer is waiting for her other child to buy her own products. She states it's a free country and she can record. Although we are in a free country and people are allowed to record, you can be asked to stop recording in a private establishment and be asked to leave. If you refuse, you can be arrested or banned from a store. Exactly. If someone's breaking the law, she ain't breaking no law crying. The employee has had enough of the customer and is threatening to call the cops. In this case, if the lady were to stay in the store, she'll cause trouble for herself. What you gonna do? A, a four, a five-year-old's crying? There you go. You keep on, don't you? Make sure she gives you the correct change. <laughs> Well, she doesn't have to be quiet. Yeah, I asked you nicely. She does not have to be quiet. It's a free country. Kids cry. It's not a free country, ma'am. Here It's not a free <laughs> I'm guessing the employee means you're not free to do what you want in the store. Thank you. You gave me my bag. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, keep your Dollar Tree storage out. Keep your Dollar Tree storage out. You're going to be so successful. Good job. I don't usually stop shop at Dollar Tree. Don't have to. Don't have to. What are your thoughts on this? Do you think the mother did enough to try and keep the child quiet? What do you think about the lady talking down on the employee's job, especially in front of her children?